The drunk driver is recovering this morning after crashing his car, causing a flood and turning a gas station into a heap of scrap metal. It was all captured on videos right. out there. Well, it's not too late to get your honey some flowers for Valentine's Day. Up next, we found a place that is staying open for the next 36 hours. Some scary moments when a woman gets hit by a car on the side of a highway. She only had minor injuries, but we want to warn you, the video may be disturbing. Did you wait until the last minute to get flowers for Valentine's Day? You're in luck. The California Flower Mall is extending its hours this weekend. It's a great place to check out. They're at 825 San Pedro Street in downtown L.A. The shop opened at 430 this morning and will not close, guys or ladies, until 7 o'clock tomorrow night. Love. Well, family in Burbank now has a Purple Heart earned by their Army hero injured during World War I. The bill would allow drug tests for those who receive food stamps. The they may only be in kindergarten, but a whole classroom of kids in Anaheim is already working on their college education. Thanks to a Good Samaritan and a million-dollar gift, Miguel Almaguer has a story. Beautiful story. Well, the Pope is in Mexico for an historic visit, and so is NBC4's John Caddy's Climac. We'll check in with John because the Pope's welcoming ceremony is about Actor to... Actor Bill Murray is accused of uh, throwing cell phones from a group of fans off a rooftop in Carmel. Hey, thank you, Shauna. Well, the Pope is just about to officially start his historic visit to Mexico. NBC4's John Caddy's Climac is live in Mexico City, where a huge crowd is welcoming Pope Francis this morning. Buenos dias to you, John. Meanwhile, a woman in her 20s is dead this morning, burned alive in a fiery crash. This was near MacArthur Park. For 736 right now, the Olympics in Rio are just about six months away. The countdown is on. Today, the Summer Olympic competition is back here in Los Angeles. The U.S. team will try to pick its marathon runners for the games in Rio. Marion. A Laker legend has a chance to become immortal. The big nod to one big man. He just received I it. I hope they get caught. A shooter remains on the run this morning after opening fire into a home in Lincoln High. Two bank robberies in just 30 minutes this morning. Police in Orange County are looking for the man they say is behind both of well, them. It's an offer Kanye West can't refuse. $10 million from former pharmaceutical CEO Martin Shkreli. Well, an Australian boy saved Sydney for uh, his make-a-wish. Then he transformed it to Iron Boy, and Iron Man had something to say about it. Well, the Pope's welcoming ceremony is well underway in Mexico City. We'll take you there next.